Hello and welcome to an episode of Smite. What's poppin' hood? That's you're not hood. I ain't never calling you that again. <laughs> That's disrespectful. My apologies. Hold on, I gotta take a swig of this order. Mm. <clears throat> that is some good H2O. Now, if you're unfamiliar with what a swig is, it is a volume of liquid equaling about one mouthful. So a swig, you don't gulp it, you know? Well, I mean, a swig, all right, hear me out, hear me out, all right? A swig is not something that you, you gulp in succession. You fill your mouth up one time with the liquid and then you remove the, the container of liquid from your esophagus port. I don't want this one. And then you have a mouthful of uh, liquid that you then um, do something with, you swallow. That is what a swig is. Talk about a swig, you don't take a sip. It's not a sip. It's another way to say mouthful. But when you say mouthful, you might, that, that's a very inaccurate amount because then it's dependent on how a big a person's mouth is. Like if I say, oh, yeah, let me get a mouthful real fast. You'd be like, oh, when he says mouthful, how does he mean mouthful? Does he mean like, does he mean like, um, a mouthful of his mouth? Does he mean like a mouthful of his dog's mouth? You know what I'm saying? No. When someone says mouthful, you question what they determine a mouthful is. What do they think a mouthful is? You know? So if like, you can't, this is too independent based upon an individual's criteria of measure. But when you say a swig, that literally means to fill their mouth all the way up. If someone classifies a mouthful, that doesn't mean, you, you don't have a guarantee that mean their entire mouth. That's, that's what a swig is. If you were unfamiliar, hence. It is something I refer to often, though. Fucking played, bitch. Fucking double played. She really just threw that into a wall. Freaking hilarious. But yeah. So I took a swig of hydration. It was delectable. Man. My lead skill has been pretty alright. Um, fucking canceled, bitch. All the rooms. Eh, bro. Kill bestowed. You're welcome. Man, people really love it just attacking the tank. You know what I'm saying? Can't stop, won't stop, baby, let's go. Come on. Ally down. I was just waiting for this damn line. <clears throat> Pythagoras, please! They expect me to tank? Fuck that. I was talking to Mercury when I told him to attack the left lane. He fucking missed, bro. This guy is garbage. J Dog carry, J Dog carry, J Dog carry. Have a little, have a little buff from Pythagorean's piece. Yo, all right. So you know Super Auto Pets. Perhaps you do, perhaps you don't. I'm going to talk about it. All right, Super Auto Pets. This is a game that came out, uh, I would say, relatively recently, all right? It's a free-to-play game. It's great. It's fun. I'm like, hey, friends, you guys want to play Super Auto Pets? I'm like, you guys want to play Super Auto Pets? I'm like, hey, you guys want to play Super Auto Pets? And uh, each and every time I get a resounding negative response, no. 
I don't want to play some game I've never played before. So, all right. My buddy Christian, I go, hey, Christian, you want to try out this new game? It's free. It wouldn't hurt to attempt. And uh, he's like, sure, fine. He finally says yes. This dude will not get off of the game. I can't, I can't move. I'm sad. He will not get off of Super Auto Pets. He's like, bro, we just play versus mode, 1v1s, which is pretty all right. It's not, it's not crazy or nothing. Cause there's a uh, super auto pets has an arena mode where you have four lives and you gotta go through, and then it has a just a versus mode where you can have like a party of individuals. We've gotten up to I've gotten two other people to agree, but that makes three. You can't you have to have an even number because of the way the game works. I ain't gonna explain it to you, but this guy loves the game. He's like, let's do it. Yesterday I got off work. This motherfucker and me played super auto pets for three hours. That's in my mind is just ridiculous. Be right back. Why do we play Super Auto Pets for three hours? Super Auto Pets for three hours. Man, I hate this bitch. Damn, what killed me? A basic, bro. The fucking asshole over here just beats the shit out of me. You know what really makes me mad? Tell you straight. Uh, Thanatos has a cross gender skin. Not a big fan of that, personally. That's a, that's kind of disrespect to the gods. Like, all right, I like this game. This game's great. I love I love the gods, right? I respect the gods. Talk about the gods, 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 gods. You know what I'm saying? I, I love mythology. I'm all for it, dude. Where I got a fucking problem, though, is the high-res guys are like, yeah, bro. Let's just, like, do the popular thing so we get more money. And, oh, yeah, we're all, like, pro this and pro that. They're pro everything, man. And it's like, you guys have no individuality. You are insulting the literal gods by doing whatever the fuck you want. Like, I'm sorry to tell you this. There are gods of, of uh, sexuality and shit. Feminine gods, masculine gods. It ain't no, ain't no gods have gender. And you can't just be like, oh, I guess it's a female now. Shit, there's a show called uh, Fate Stay Night. They did that shit with, um, what you call it? They did that shit, Fate Stay Night. They did it with King Arthur. I can't even watch the show. Because it's like, you know what, King Arthur's going to be a female. I'm like, dude, I can't, I can't watch this. You are changing history. I don't like it. If you're not familiar, it's, it's an anime. It's called Fate Stay Night. It's like, it's got the most confusing storyline possible. It's not understandable. But uh, if you want to see a female King Arthur, that's, uh, ain't got, it's got some fan service. Ain't got too much. Commendable on that mark. But that's all I'm saying. Oh, I got yacked, bro. Nice job, teammates. Nice job. But I'm not a big fan of this whole, like, uh, let's just change the gender of this individual. I mean, I understand it's a ruby skin from the anime Ruby made by Rooster Teeth. Oh, oh they just lost their word, bro. Fuck. Bing! Get out of clear lane in two seconds. Fuck off. He's a Nami as fuck. I was gonna tell her to retreat, but I didn't have to. Rah, heal me, bro. Heal me. Heal me. Heal me. 500 HP is missing from my freaking uh, bar. You clear the lane. I hardly get any assists. I'm not gonna help you. Now will you heal me? There we go. It was so hard to do. It was so hard to heal me, bro. Piece of garbage. I hope he loses this game. I was forced into being a tank roll, the only tank roll. I have like a third of their kills. This Ra's crap. Oh, what? Oh, 
bullshit, bro. Nobody's following up. Oh my god. I hate my teammates. Y'all are shit. I'm just gonna not miss. That's gonna be my prerogative. I'm just gonna not miss. Mercury's garbage. Babiago's garbage. <sighs> I'm not playing the best, but I'll tell you what, bro. Believe you me, these guys are idiots. Jeez, man. Jeez. Magical defense, eh? I'd just grab, uh, I like Bulwark of Hope. I'm a big fan. I also like, uh, what's the other item? Something, bro. Hoey's got life seal out the bum. Thanatos has life seal because he's Thanatos. Kuku Khan and Ulurun don't have too much sustain. Ulurun's grabbing it, though. I really thought I would have canceled that, but it's fine. I hit it with the silence. Psych, bro. Not cancelled, not cancelled. I don't get any minion assist, bro. It just doesn't exist. Ooh, played, played. Ooh, look at that knock, bruh. All it takes. Immune, immune, Mercury, you're trash, you're trash, Mercury's trash. Yoink, yoink. Ah, immune. Sad. She got a quadra. He, he, she. You know what? What a faggot. I'm glad we lost this game. It makes me happy to see a shit team lose. Motherfucker said, I want to play double mage. Motherfucker said, I want to play uh, assassin on the tank. Motherfucker said, uh, we're going to lose because we all suck. I'm Izanami. Oh. Izanami's going for one weird build. Let's see here. Baba Yaga's going in stacks as a Baba Yaga would. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Well, okay, so a, a critique. Mercury is grabbing crits. He does it basic. Mercury does not. Oh, I guess it's his one ability crits. But he's, he's not getting any assists or kills. So he's not getting stack pops. He's not getting stacks at all. You know, I'll just stay right lane. If I die, I die. It's a shame. That's all I gotta say about it. Because see this lane right here? This is my money. Or at least it would be if I could, like, kill him. Oh, I hit him all, oh, bro. Yeah, I don't really know where my um my first ability went. I don't know if I ever shot that thing. I'm glad Mercury's dead. I ain't helping him. You see how I help engage the left lane and use my ult and slaughtered people? Ultimate did like, I hit three enemy gods for a total of 100, 300, plus uh, 400, that's 300, 400, 900 damage total with my ult. And uh, nobody followed up, Mercury was never to be found. How am I looking at defenses? Does it matter? I don't know, man. I did not make it. Okay. So close. Said. Thanatos hit you three times. Man, how much pen, though? What's up with that? Damage goes through me. If I have 100 physical protection, then it gets half damage. 
Thanatos is going through 25%, so he's treating it like I have... I only have like 50 protections when fighting him, so he's penetrating like a hundred, like a 70, 70 pen. That doesn't sound right. Oh, we lost. You know, that's an unexpected shame. It's almost like we, we didn't lose because my team was garbage. I'm sad. I'm sorry you had to watch this, this salt video, this video of salt and betrayal. We had a good start talking about uh, something, and now it's just falling apart. Uh, I'm sorry for your loss. What a waste of time.